Hey, what's up everybody? How's it going? I'm the Friend, and welcome back to the next episode of my DL2 Lower Destruction Let's Play with the Amazon. Alright, so in the last episode, we were able to find the Scroll of Infuse so that we can go and save Decker Kane. And that's essentially what we're going to do here in today's episode. Look at my quest log really fast. We got to, uh, here we go. Um, go back to the Stony Fields and go through the portal to Tristram to save Deckard Kane. That's what we're going to do, so let's get going. <clears throat> I've already got a TP portal set up here for the Stony Fields. I'm right here by the stone outcropping, and uh, we just need to figure out which uh, stones we need to, need to hit. And I have no idea which ones are which, so I just gotta click on them randomly, and hopefully I figure it out eventually. And I picked up a potion on accident, so we're just gonna get rid of that. Alright, the portal is open, so let's go ahead and head right on through there. A great war. Yes. Alright, so what we gotta do is actually... Well, the really only thing we have to do is save Decker Kane right there, but... There's gonna be a lot of... <laughs> she's really loud. There's gonna be a lot of enemies here, so we're just gonna go ahead and kill majority of them. And... Man, the audio feels really loud right now. Going to uh, kill these guys really fast so they don't hit me in the face. Alright, what we're going to do, I want to turn the sound down just a little bit, because that's really loud in my ears right now. Okay, so <clears throat> let's go ahead and pick up some of this money, because uh, Champion Packs actually dropped quite a bit, and we're, we'll kill Griswold yet, wherever he's at. We'll go ahead and kill Griswold, just because, and we're going to use a multiple shot here, because I can life leech off of a lot of these guys, and I'm at a mana. Let's go ahead and use a mana potion. And see if we can kill some of these guys. And we got a shaman over there in the lower left-hand corner. Kind of want to take him down. Oh, he is actually a boss. Well, okay then. What I'm going to do, I'm going to try and get a little bit closer so I can actually hit this guy. Oh, he's immune, immune to fire. So I'm going to go ahead and use uh, <clears throat> Strafe here. And there we go. Now that he is down, I can use... Wow, I need arrows. Holy cow. Okay, well, I guess I'll grab some arrows when I go back to town. Alright, so we just gotta keep hitting this guy until he dies. Using Strafe here because it is, you know, quote unquote, my boss killer. And it was doing a, a little bit more damage uh, to, and, or to single target enemies, I guess. That could have killed me. That, that definitely could have killed me. Alright, so let's pick up some of this stuff here. Belrog Blade over there. Don't really care about that. Let's just go ahead and use a potion. Uh, just because. And I could go around and take on a lot more of these enemies around here, but it's really not necessary right now. Um, <clears throat> I'm I'm a little over-leveled. Let's put it that way. <laughs> so I'm not going to worry about that too much. And uh, get something from a car here. Get a, get a ring. And it is a very crappy ring. Holy cats. Uh, gives me some mana and that fire resist, though. But the rings that I have right now are... Oodles upon oodles better, so I'm going to keep that. And actually, what is this ring from? Gives me fire resist and better magic finding. See, I think I might keep this just because I'm going to be doing some runs a little later, uh, later on, excuse me, in the pit. <clears throat> might want some magic find for that. So I'm going to keep those, but I am going to pick up uh, some more, more keys. Just go like that. Good enough. All right, so what we got to do now is head over here to Charcy. We got to pick up some more arrows. And then we're going to go and make our way uh, through the uh, Black Marsh. I think that's what it's called. Anyways, let's repair stuff and uh, head. Oh, we got to pick up arrows. I about didn't do the one thing that I meant to come over here for. All right, let's pick up. Uh, let's just get rid of that and go like that. Call that good. All right, so now that we got all that taken care of, we're going to. We're over here to the waypoint. Go to the Darkwood. Did I say Blackwood? I don't remember what I said. But anyways, we got to go and find our way to the next area, which is right over here if you look at my mini-map. So we're just going to start heading in that direction. I don't really want to take on too many of these enemies. Oh, but I'm going to have to because I'm going to get surrounded. Whew, that was close. All right, multiple shot coming in super handy here. Let's go. And this is actually a boss pack right here, but taking them down, no problemo. There we go. All right, so we're going to pick that up. Do I need potions? I could use a mana potion. Let's go ahead and pick that up. All that good. Not going to worry about anything else. Got to dodge this guy. Get the old Dodgerino out. <clears throat> Take that guy down. There we go. What kind of... Okay, Superior Maiden Pike. I don't really care about that. Multiple shot. Look how big of an area I can take down enemies with. That is just beautiful. 
Okay, that's just a big group of enemies I don't care about. Gonna run, okay, gonna take these guys down, kinda run away a little bit. There we go, pick up the ring. And head, okay. <laughs> Lots of enemies, got one coming up right behind me. I'm gonna just bounce right on over here <clears throat> where I can't get hit. And take down all these guys. There we go. That was that was too bad, right? Nah, it was fine. All right, so I am cursed, but hopefully that'll wear off before too. Okay, Black Marsh. Okay, so here in the Black Marsh, what we want to try and accomplish here in today's episode is essentially find the waypoint as well as the uh, the Forgotten Tower. We're not gonna go into the Forgotten Tower here in today's episode because I'm assuming that's gonna take a little while, and uh, I don't want to. Uh, have this episode be like a 20 minute or 25 minute episode or whatever it would end up being. Um, so we're going to just try and find the waypoint here and then make our way uh, to the uh, to the Forgotten Tower. And a lot of full rejuves are dropping, which is actually pretty cool, even though I don't really need them at this point. I already got full in my uh, in my belt. This is actually another boss pack. Good gravy. Take these guys down. Where, there he is. Oh, he's immune to physical. Um, I could switch to magic arrow, but eh, it's whatever. I think this is going down just as fast with the fire damage. Call that good. There we go. Ow, I just got hit by that. All right, so <clears throat> another boss pack. Holy goodness. And I'm cursed again, so no big deal. Take all these guys down. Looks like they're actually hurting my uh, my minions. Pretty decently. That's okay. They'll be fine, right? Alright, so let's pick up that money right there. And like I said, we're going to try and find the the waypoint and the tower. So we're just going to... Good gravy, this is another boss pack, isn't it? No, it's not. I thought it was. I thought I saw an aura around one of them. Alright, let's just follow the path here. And it will... This is a boss pack. Yep, it's a boss pack. Uh, immune to cold, it looks like. That's, that's just fine. I don't really care about that. Ooh. See, I gotta start standing a little bit further back. Because that probably... If that would have hit me, it probably would have done a great... Great great a lot of damage. <laughs> but uh, let's just keep going here. And Okay, so we found the Forgotten Tower. <clears throat> right here. And if we're lucky... Which I'm never lucky is... Uh, you know, the, the waypoint will be right close to where the tower is. But, you know, that never happens to me. But we did find the hole right here, which is, uh, not, it's, it's kind of whatever. I don't really care about uh, that particular dungeon <clears throat> for right now. The only dungeon I want is the pit. Okay, so he's immune to fire, so we're just going to go ahead and use this guy to get all the damage off. All that good. Got one guy right here. There we go. Take him out. And, man, I really want the waypoint. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad, right? That's not a bad uh, distance. Yeah, that's pretty decent. Pretty decent. All right, so if I end up doing Countess runs, well, I, I most definitely will be doing Countess runs at some point um, here in Hell Difficulty. So that, it's a pretty good distance, um, or it's manageable at least from the Forgotten Tower. So we're not going to worry about that too much. All right, take those guys down. All right, so, wow, that, that that was a pretty short episode. <laughs> pretty much accomplished everything I wanted to here uh, in a pretty quick amount of time. I think, let's see, I, 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 I have to end things here for today just because I, I'm feeling the tower's going to take a little while, or it's going to take, man, it's going to take maybe 15 minutes. So I don't want to make this episode go too long. So I am going to end things here for today. Let's run over to the um, to a car here and just sell some stuff. Uh, get rid of press the wrong button. Right, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Energy don't care. <clears throat> interesting. Interesting. All right. So don't really need arrows. Call that good. But yeah, I am going to th end things here for today. Um, in the next episode, we'll make our way up to, or I guess it's down actually, down to the very bottom of the Forgotten Tower. And uh, take on the Countess and uh, do all that. 
But yeah, we're going to end things here for today. So if you like what you saw, go ahead and hit that like button. If you have any comments, questions, advice, go ahead and leave those in the comment section. If you'd like to stay up to date with what I'm doing here with my Diablo 2 lower section let's play, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'd also appreciate it if you went to my Facebook page and my Twitch page and like follow me over there. I'm actually doing a lot more streaming recently, so it'd be actually really awesome if you guys could go over to my Facebook page and like me over there because that's where I post uh, updates on when I'm going to stream. Um, but also go over to my Twitch page and follow me over there and so you get noti notifications for that. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day.